focusing on you. Innovations in modern medicine from your team of experts at UHealth, the University of Miami Health System. Competitive cyclist Alexis Cespedes survived a near fatal collision with another rider during a race just one month ago. I crashed in the first lap, hit the crown pretty hard, and was airlifted to the nearest trauma center. Alexis suffered a concussion and several broken bones. He soon met with Dr. Abraham Chilowet, a sports neurologist at UHealth. So is this something that's a specialty? I mean, t kind of talk to us about, it seems like it's a specialty that you wouldn't see at all locations. Well, sport neurology is a very brand new kind of subspecialty that we have here. And we need to assess uh, injuries of the nervous system. And the main one is going to be the brain, central nervous system, concussions, but it will also do a lot of peripheral and nervous system. We do counseling about people that have neurological problems and education that have neurological problems, uh, headaches, uh, multiple sclerosis, that uh, want to engage in physical activity, not only sports, but physical activity. And while headaches can be the main symptom of a concussion, Dr. Chilowitz says there are other signs to watch out for. Dizziness, imbalance, mental fog, confusion, nausea, being irritable or emotional are very typical. He says every brain injury is different, and that's why each patient at UHealth's concussion clinic receives personalized treatment by a team of specialists. Psychology is heavily involved in people that have problems with the thought process. We have neuropsychologists and staff that are specialized in traumatic brain injury. Alexis says he wouldn't be here right now if it wasn't for that helmet. It was pretty scary. I mean, the helmet, like, I have it right here. As soon as the U Health team gives him his clearance, Alexis plans to ride again, but with a life-saving message to everyone. Always wear a helmet.